Now, let's bring you this. Uh, Liverpool fans were unfairly blamed for the chaos that surrounded last season's Champions League final in Paris to divert attention from the failure of the organisers. That's according to a French Senate report uh, that has come out this morning. The Senate has heard from Red supporters along with French police, government officials and UEFA's events director Martin Callan since the match on May the 28th which kicked off more than half an hour late. France's interior minister, Gérald Darmanin, initially laid the blame for the delays at the door of ticketless Liverpool supporters for the build-up of crowds at the perimeter of the Stade de France, with police also using tear gas on fans as they waited to gain entry. Now, the provisional report of its findings, published on Wednesday, stated it is unfair to have wanted to make supporters of the Liverpool team bear the responsibility for the disturbances that occurred as the Minister of Interior did divert attention from the inability of the state to adequately manage the crowds present and to curb the action of several hundred violent and coordinated offenders. The report found the chaos had been caused by a chain of events and malfunctions in the days and hours leading up to kickoff. The report added the systems put in place had major shortcomings with regards to the intelligence, that's the absence of hooligans, but presence of delinquents in large numbers, the transfer routes for supporters, the removal of a drop-off route at the surroundings of the stadium, and insufficient communication. Uh, they go on to say it is not only in the execution that problems arose upstream, the crisis scenarios were insufficiently worked on and did not demonstrate the necessary flexibility in the face of so many unanticipated events. The Senate report said the French authorities must learn the lessons from the serious collective failure which had occurred and apply them to next year's hosting of the Rugby World Cup and the 2024 Olympic Games.